there. Lost or something? Uh, uh, I'm sorry. I was just look at your lights. Very beautiful display. Hey, hey, man. It's all right. I put up the decorations this year. I hope too. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's nice. Um, I'm, I don't want any trouble. I don't have any money. I'm well, sorry. No, no, wait. Wait. Come. Come. You look like you're pretty cold. Just look at them. I didn't put mine up this year. Okay. Can't afford it. Really? Why not? I'm behind on my bills and I recently got divorced with my wife. I can't afford anything for my little girl. I want to cry, but I know I can't. I gotta stay strong for her. Hey, why don't you come over? I can heat up some coffee and then you can take it for the road. Warm yourself up. Go wherever you're going. Feel a little bit better. Yeah. Guys, I, I just don't want to intrude. I don't want to be like, uh, you know, a mooch. Thanks, but thank you for the offer, but I think I should go. Hey, you're not mooching off anybody. My bad for not introducing myself. It's okay. Hey, you too. Chris. Clarence. Mm -hmm. You too, Chris. And, um, my name's Nick. If you wanted to know, uh, Chris, right? Chris Biggs. Oh, Chris, man. All right, uh, well, the night's cold. It's Christmas Eve, right? Hey, Let's get out freezing out here. Come on. Let's get in here. Come on, Claire. Here. Here. Take your jacket off. We'll hang it up over here. Oh. Come on, guys, but get yourselves comfortable. I got the coffee ready. That was fast. All right, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Come on. Uh, Nick, there's only three cups there. What three? Oh, I'm I'm terribly sorry, Chris. It's okay. Uh, I appreciate it. But... I don't know what to say. I, I guess I just we didn't expect that we we're getting a visitor. We're gonna make sure that uh, we get another extra here. I'll make you a cup, okay? You just stay stay with um, you know Clarence and Jacob. They'll entertain you. They're very entertaining guys. But I'll make you another cup, okay? So, Chris, tell us why were you wandering off in the street alone at night? I just need time to think about my life and what to do next year. Take your time, man. You know, you just gotta be merry for the moment, all right? Merry? Yeah, right. Not anymore. You did say you had a daughter, right? Yeah. She's with her mother, I mean, my ex-wife's house for the night. Ooh, I see. 
right. Not to be nosy, but uh, how long have you and your wife been divorced for? We've been separated for a year and we've been divorced now for about four years to this month. Ouch, during the holidays? Wow, man. Of course, perfect timing. Um, I really haven't been a perfect husband for my wife those last couple of years we've been together before the divorce and, but I've been trying to be a good dad for my little angel. All right, my friend, I got you a cup. So now we can all enjoy our coffees. So, there you go. Are you enjoying yours, uh, Jacob? Well, guys, I hope everybody wasn't uh, in too impatient for my absence because I have to make our guest of honor here, Chris. We are pretty much happy to see you, so I want to have a cheers to Chris. To, to Chris. Chris. And to Christmas. To Christmas. Merry Christmas. Mm. Mm. Do I make good coffee or what? That you do, good friend, good. man. That you yeah. do. Thank you. So well, I've been overhearing that uh, our friend has problems, huh? Yeah. What type of problems? Yeah, I've been divorced for the past four years. Mm -hmm. It's been tough. I've been in self-doubt right now, hopping between jobs and jobs, you know, trying to get a online college degree, but honestly, everything I do, I just lose interest or I'm just not emotionally there. No wonder if she thought I was a failure. I don't know what to tell you. It's not easy going through divorce. I have been through three divorces, actually. Yeah, uh, it's hard to explain. Well, let's just say I made many mistakes. Hey, who well, hasn't made any mistakes? Lord knows how many I've made, too. Listen, we all make mistakes, my friend. Every one of us. But without mistakes, we will not learn from them, don't we? Not me. Mistakes cost me my wife, my little kid. The damage has already been done. I keep on screwing up and screwing up. No matter how hard I try, I just always make mistakes and keep on falling through the same circle over and over and over again. I'm a failure. I don't even deserve to see my kid ever again. Look. Chris, you're an intelligent guy. It'll take time, but this problem should resolve itself. Hey, patience is what it takes, man. It's a necessary skill to have. All you have to do is just pick up the pieces, man. That's all you have to do. Well, I don't know where to start. It's not easy. And plus, you know, before those three wives, I had a loved one, my true love, and I let it go. I let her go because I was too afraid. And I tried to do it three times with three different women throughout the years. You think that's easy? No, especially not during these holidays. I haven't seen my family in years, man. Mainly because I've been uh, ruining a lot of good times that they've been trying to have without me. Even with me for that matter. And whenever I did, they uh, declared me as the black sheep of the family. Because uh, after that, I tried uh, gambling, and it became a killer, believe me. Never do that shit. And I w thought I could drink away my problems, but uh, that didn't work either. And uh, that was such a pain for me too. Yeah, it's not easy. Yeah, man, you know, my parents really pushed the books when I was back in Harvard. Got that degree from all the way. But, you know, in the end, I just put all my effort in my career. And I didn't really get the good things out of life. True lover, friends. I mean, I got the money, but that's it. Well, it could be worse. Like, uh, you could be burning alive, or you can be uh, killed just like that. And the worst thing is, you won't have a chance to fix your problems. So, think of it this way. 
You have a whole life ahead of you still. Wow. Mm -hmm. Hear it all through your stories. Really inspired me. Just trying to do better for my life. You know what? You guys are right. I need to stop feeling sorry for myself. Thank you for sharing all of your stories. We all make mistakes in life. You know what? But the mistakes we we make in life makes us a better person. If we live through them, we can learn from them. Live and learn from our mistakes. Keep on going. I can't keep on putting myself down. Not for my little girl. She's looking at me as her, as her hero. I gotta be that hero she needs me to be. I need to step up. I need to do better. I will do better. I gotta stop making excuses. I will be a better man. You know, since it's Christmas Eve, I got this little something extra. Got a little bonus last week, and I thought maybe, well, I think you deserve it more than me. Oh, God, Jake, Jake, I appreciate it, but I, I can't take your money. You need it for your family, your Christmas. I don't have family. I just have lots of stuff. You need it more than I do. Well, since we're giving away our gifts, I got something here for you. This is my uh, wife's jewelry that I collected over the years that they didn't want anymore. So you can do anything with those jewelry. You can go to a gold and silver shop, maybe get some extra cash. You need to uh, get your finances back, pal. That right there, that jewelry box is the answer. Well, since uh, they give you their gifts, it's only fair that I give you mine. See, what I used to do was travel the world and collect a lot of coins. A lot of rare coins that uh, you can't find anymore. Like very rare ones. If you find anybody who be willing, who have been looking for these coins for a long time now, will pay you good money to have these. Clarence, Clarence, are, are you sure? Positive. Guys, guys, please, please. I don't even have anything to give you. You don't have to give us anything. Quite frankly, we don't need anything for Christmas. I don't know what to say. <laughs> right. Wow. <laughs> wow. You have no idea what this means to me. And I promise you, I won't use this for granted. I will use this money towards the greater good to make my life better, to make my daughter's life better. At least have a talking relationship with my ex-wife. I would do it for all three of you guys and for myself. Thank, thank you, thank you for this. I, I won't let any of you guys down. I promise. Well, I think we uh, should deserve another toast for Mr. Uh, Chris or Briggs, is it? Chris Biggs. Chris Biggs. Mm -hmm. So, gentlemen, shall we? That's right. And a Merry Christmas to new friends. Merry Christmas. All right, down the hatchet. God, your coffee's really good. I definitely gotta come back here again and try to get more of your famous coffee. It's a secret recipe, so don't spread it out. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> And I, I appreciate it, but I gotta get ready to go. I need to call my ex-wife. I need to call my daughter. Tell her. Tell them. Let's. Are you sure things. could have make you another cop? Ah oh, man, Nick, I appreciate it, but right now I got about four years to make up for my family, and I'm gonna do it right now. Thanks, guys. You guys are awesome. Yeah. Well, we hope that you have a nice, safe travel. This means so much to me. Cheers. Thank you guys. I definitely will come visit you guys soon again. Oh yeah. Likewise. Nice. Yep. Cheers. Thank you so much. Merry Christmas to you guys and God bless. Merry Christmas.